In 1972, John Wojtowicz had a problem. He was broke. Because of this, he was unable to afford the male-to-female sex change operation his lover, Ernie Aaron, was in desperate need of, or he wanted. So he decided to rob a Chase Manhattan bank, which naturally went incredibly wrong, ending with a highly publicized 14-hour standoff and the death of his accomplice, Sal Naturale. Meanwhile, Wojciechowicz served five years in prison. He also sold the rights to his story, which was made in the acclaimed movie Dog Day Afternoon, starring Al Pacino and John Cazale. Oddly, on the afternoon of the robbery, Wojciechowicz had taken his accomplice to see The Godfather, starring Al Pacino and John Cazale. Although he was paid hundred grand for the making of Dog Day Afternoon, Wojtowicz actually didn't get very much money since the courts ordered most of the fee diverted to the victims of the bank robbery. What little money he did receive went towards Aaron's operation, and unfortunately Aaron left him after the surgery, prompting his um, suicide attempt. Ultimately, Wojtowicz had never would find any more success in his life. The money he was hoping would come from the film never appeared despite decades of court battles. He moved back in with his mother and found work cleaning toilets, but his attempt to apply for a security guard job at the very same bank he had robbed didn't quite work out as he had planned. In his later years, he would stand outside the building wearing a t-shirt, I robbed this bank and charge money for autographs. He remained on welfare until his death in 2006.